In today's video, I'm gonna be talking about the CC Sabres Grandmaster. So let's get right into it. So this is the CC Sabres Grandmaster and this thing is small. It's small. So this is um, installed by CC Sabres with a Profi board. You got some buttons here. These are also accent lights and I'll show those off, but this, is, this thing is awesome. It also comes with a static emitter and a static pommel. Uh, don't have these on it currently because you know we're gonna turn it on everything of course it's a lightsaber it's fully installed we gotta do that so like i said before this is installed with a profi board and it's fully installed by cc sabers so you can just get you know one of these straight from cc sabers removable chassis is a great chassis setup the board is is hidden right behind here and you got your little kill switch the dark side I sense in you. turns right on super easy you got the accent lights those are Awesome, those are also your buttons as well. So if you just slide it back in, the lights, the accent lights are now on. And like I said, these are also your buttons. So you got your power button here and then, you know, your accent there. So this thing is awesome. Then you, got, you know, you got your little, your little blade plug right there. So gesture controls, of course, so let's just, Put a blade in this thing. So got a little blade in it. This is a three-fourths blade, 24 inch. This thing is tiny, dude. This thing is tiny. Also, it is kind of wobbly, so I won't be going absolutely insane swinging it. Plus, I'm in a really small room, a little, little small area, so not gonna go absolutely insane. But we're gonna throw, go through a few fonts. So starting with Yoda. This is from Kyrophonic. Obviously, this is his hilt. Super sick. I see why a lot of people get these uh, kind of Yoda sabers because they're a lot of fun to just swing. Next one. I am Bastille Sean. You know, it's the wrong color, but you know, we keep it going. This is kind of, it, honestly, it's kind of cool having the blue saber with like the green accents. That's actually kind of sick, I'm not gonna lie. Let's go to the next one. Going somewhere. I don't know why it's purple. <laughs> but Second Sister, one of the greatest fonts ever made. I've done this font a lot of times on the channel. That lightsaber. Was Luke's. So this is Kaseth Graflex episode seven. This is honestly probably my first time swinging it around. This sound font. It has a very deep hum. I like the ignition. I like that ignition. That ignition is so sick. Yeah, no. Yeah. Command, Commander Tano. Commander Tano, yeah. Yeah, from season seven. Come on, man, it's your font. I know. <laughs> That's staying in the video. <laughs> so, Commander Tano, season seven. Super sick. Is there a force down? Yeah. Super sick. Ray Skywalker. That's right, Ray Skywalker. So the scavenger, Kyberphonic, like yellow blade, green accents. That's kind of a vibe, I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool having different colors on the Yoda saber. It's like a lot of sabers like having a different blade with like certain colors. It doesn't work, but I feel like for this hill, it does work. That's really cool. I am a Jedi, like my father before me. So this is the Return V1 Kyberphonic. <laughs> Obi Wan Kenobi. And Obi Wan. Ooh. V1 trash. Apparently. <laughs> oh, 
those blasters, though. Taking your first step into a larger world. That's right. I didn't go over all the fonts, because there's like 30 of them, but y'all get the idea. It sounds really good for the size that it is, you know, judge it by the size, do you? This, you know, that's what Yoda says. Um, but super sick. I'm gonna have to pick me up one for my own, because this is dope. So shout out to Jesse for letting me review this. And thank you for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with someone who might enjoy it as well. And I'll talk to y'all on the next one. Look, I just flipped the switch. I don't know nobody else's